best job in the world. Here we go. Are you ready? Okay. Three, two. Good morning. I'm Scott Meyer. Thanks for joining me today. Topping our news, Kyrie Irving has been fined 25K for chucking the game ball into the stands after the Celtics game on Monday. Irving threw the ball in anger when Denver Nuggets guard Jamal Murray threw up a last second shot even though his team was winning. Murray was trying to reach 50 points for the first time in his career. Irving and the rest of his team felt disrespected by Murray's last second shot. However, Murray said no hard feelings that he didn't mean to offend anybody. That's a lot of words for the third year guard. College basketball is back and Duke looks powerful. After picking up the first, second, and third ranked recruits in the country, Duke had the number one recruiting class. Although they are currently ranked fourth in the country right now, they beat down the second ranked Kentucky Wildcats last night, 118 to 84. Did you see that game? Kentucky got beat down. The latest college football rankings came out last night, and Alabama and Clemson remained number two, respectively. Notre Dame moved up to three as they remain undefeated after their win against Northwestern. Michigan has moved to the fourth spot after blowing out Penn State and Ann Arbor. Nobody thought that was coming. Georgia sits at the five spot, but they will have their chance to make the playoffs when they face Alabama on December 1st in the SEC Championship. Number six, Oklahoma, will probably need a top five team to lose in order to make the playoffs. And I don't know if that's really just looking likely right now. And week 11 of college football is coming up. Top-ranked Alabama will finally be staying home and playing number 16, Mississippi State. 24, Auburn will be playing number five, Georgia, in Athens. And Georgia will try to look for revenge from last year. Number 10, Ohio State will play number 18, Michigan State. And college game day will be at Boston to see number two Clemson play number 17 Boston College. Maybe some things will shake up in the rankings next week. Thanks for joining me. I'm Scott Meyer, and have a great day. That one felt good.